Hello, everybody. Welcome to Comment Commentary. Thank you for lending your eyeballs and ears to us for a little bit. My name is Joe Beretta. I'm Lee Newton. Lee Newton. And not Elliot Morgan. It's oh, Sam Basher Sam! today. Good morning. Oh, Tell the world a little bit about yourself. I'm 20 years young It's his today. birthday today! <laughs> Birthday kisses. Let's give him birthday kisses. More kisses. Sorry. More kisses. I had a dream like this. Ew. My nose got slammed while I was kissing, mm. kissing Sammy. Mm -hmm. I got no Sam slams. tastes good, everybody. He does. Mm. You taste like you just washed yourself. Well, that's weird because I didn't. Oh, no! <laughs> no. Sammy! So, yeah, Elliot's out today. Ross, everybody, they're all in Arizona doing uh, DeFranco Loves Dead Ass. Is that what they called it? Something. AZ yeah. is very clever. Ah! Yeah. I wonder how they're going to top that with any of the other states. Yeah, there's no <laughs> way. Chicago is cool. <laughs> <laughs> so, yeah, we have Sam today and. Um, <laughs> mom, 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 mom. Let's talk about the new Facebook banner. All right, our new Facebook banner is... Jason Noel! <laughs> Yay! Oh, look at them all going to Disneyland or World. Did you have fun? Did you have... Are you a mouse now? Did you have fun? Please like engage adorable. in a Did conversation with us. Can we have a little bit of back and forth, Jason Noel? We went to high school together. Did you really? Uh, maybe. <laughs> oh yeah, one other thing. We went to VidCon uh, mm -hmm. about oh, yeah. two weeks ago we now. Did. We showed you a lot of content from that, but we have one so more much. thing. We had like a like a selfie cam set up where you guys could go and talk and dance and do a bunch of stuff. So we would like to showcase some of you. My favorite source fed moment. 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 Are all the truth or dare? Anything works, Steve, and Lee sing. My favorite moment on Source Fed has to be the bloopers when all of them screw up and you get to watch like the funny stuff that they say. And it's all the table talks. When Elliot eats a bunch of detergent. We love Source Fed! Stolen weed safe gets arrested. <laughs> <laughs> Nailed it. A brilliant dude reported his stolen safe that was filled with weed, pills, and money. So we asked you guys, what's the stupidest thing that you've ever done? Oh, that was a real <laughs> question. The NL says, in middle school I was suspended for two days because during gym class some guys dared me to whip it out and I did. Whoa! I don't feel bad about showing my dick or getting suspended, but looking back on it, I realize how incredibly stupid I was not to helicopter dick. I mean, if you're gonna whip it out, you might as well helicopter dick. That's oh, bull! Oh. No, but in all fairness, I will say, if you are going to whip it out, you might as well come yeah, do a the helicopter dick. Yeah. Good, because that guy's cool. Least, like, I like him. The thing, if you whip it out and you're just doing that in gym class, it could be like, oh, that guy's like kind of messed up. But if you whip it out and you do helicopter dick, you can plead insanity after that. <laughs> 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 I don't know why he called Sir, this his stupidest the... moment. I think that's I a think, really yeah. awesome moment. I want to epic. do that. I don't think I've ever, like, I've I've done a lot of dumb things yeah, as I don't evidenced think you've by the caught. stories. That's why. I don't know if I've ever whipped it out in public. I don't think I have. You're streaked? In, I've been naked a lot. In public? Of, in, not in public, though. Just hmm. a lot of situations. I've, I've, I've ended up naked, but I've never but been, never... like, topping it off with the wiener. Ah, penis humor. But I still contend, don't take freaking pictures of your, your bits. Please. Oh, yeah. Stop sending that stuff out into the ether. It's going to come back and bite you in the butt. Yeah. Every time Joe sees anything like that, he goes, oh, Don't take pictures. This girl was a daughter. Oh. <laughs> that's like his number one thing. He's always like, oh, that's so uh, That kids. girl has a father. Oh. oh, boy. Arctic Does Minecraft said, I tried to seduce my best friend's mom. 
yeah, we're not friends anymore. Oh, does that mean you succeeded? I don't think it does. I think it means like, hey man, that's weird. Like, that's my mom. You can't do that. Have you guys seen the trailer for that movie coming out soon? It's like super dramatic with Naomi Watts, and I think, I want to say Nicole Kidman, but I think that's wrong. Uh, about the two, they, they both have sons, and they're vacationing, and then both oh. sons start oh. sleeping with each other's moms. Oh, oh no, I haven't seen that. Uh, I do seen... love that sort of, these are the mm. movies that my parents go, like, why do these need to be made? <laughs> <laughs> what is that a thing? Yeah. Naomi and Watts all... is an attractive Yeah, Naomi lady. Watts is a really, is she... and Nicole. She's pretty. Uh, you don't think Naomi oh, Watts no? is pretty? <laughs> Man, I think no, no, not King if Kong. It was the... three hours of Naomi Watts, and I'm just like, ah. It was uh, no, to be fair, it was it was two hours of Naomi Watts Sorry. and one hour of Jack Black going. <laughs> he said he didn't wear makeup for that film. Like oh. he would, like he was like <laughs> demanding that like he like, thought it was like a really cool thing, but he was like, Oh, I was gonna say I didn't That was I him taking a stand and becoming him, like, a real actor. Yeah, and then like it was like he's like, Then I saw it and I looked <laughs> the whole time. Yeah. Remember how everybody thought that was the coolest fight ever, the T-Rex and the uh, the King Kong? Yeah, I did no. they? I, yeah, yeah. And people loved it. People. He takes the mouth and just like rips it open. <laughs> My favorite was just his last line of the movie. Wait, wait, they wait, capped wait. it off with, "Twas beauty that killed the beast. <laughs> and then he walked right. away and they panned away in New York and then it ended and I'm like, Oh, uh, <laughs> so uh, thirteen threw up in the dollars are gone. <laughs> and then I saw it six more times in theaters. Oh, oh so you really? did like it? I wanted to make friends. So they're like, let's go see a movie. <laughs> you just go to movies yeah. to like, meet people. They're like, yeah, you want to see? We found this kid outside. Yeah. He had an extra King Kong ticket. Excuse me. Yeah. Pardon me. Oh. They're like, hey, you want to see Up? We need, a, we need like a third person. I'm like, I'm yeah. Sad. Hi. <laughs> nice to meet nice you. Nice to meet you too. So you like King Kong? I guess. This is I mean, my sixth was... time. Okay. What's your name? I. He's totally gonna rip that. Okay. okay. <laughs> <laughs> Hyperloop, subsonic future train of dreams. Los Angeles to San Francisco in 30 minutes on an air hockey table type system made of dreams. What would you invent to make the world a better place is what we asked you. Endless food. Endless food. Endless. <laughs> is that like a burger that never Endless goes away? Endless food, done. <laughs> I fix the world. Um, and just like reanimate the Son of a I bitch. Don't... No, because people like me who don't know, like have no hypothalamus, would be oh, like. Oh, God. Uh, yeah, if I'm that control. person, I can't, like, if there's fries, I'm like, take them away. I say that to you all the time, like, take them away. If you take it away, then I don't know it's there, and I'm stupid, and I'm like, nope. Are there any the thin mints left? There's always uh, thin mints, no. Jennifer. I know. I know. She's <laughs> 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 Three two seven said, "I would invent a machine which can convert heat from either friction or motion to convert back into energy. Then lots of problems of energy would be solved. Or just give me a cheap, simple jetpack to fly and work every day. Solve our hey. energy problems, <laughs> or, or, or give me a jetpack. Jet jet <laughs> that was a really honestly cool idea. Yeah, and then and he like, went selfish yeah. at the end. I could save the world, or oh, <laughs> oh, awesome. that's fair. That's fair. <laughs> Screw this energy and motion thing. Although I would say." That would be terrifying. Because they, they've talked about like how, oh, jetpacks are actually going to be a thing now, but they're going to be like $125,000 and not ready for another like 10 years and blah, blah, blah. I don't see how a jetpack works. And somebody correct me if I'm wrong. I understand how those water ones work because those are cool. And they also awesome. wouldn't fry your freaking legs. How does a jetpack work? You're going to burn your freaking legs off. Yeah. You got to get them out here. <laughs> you gotta fly. Gotta yeah, get them out here. You gotta get the jets this? out here. That way you, yeah. you got no. This looks ridiculous. Or have you seen that dude who's got a giant wing on his back? Yeah. He jumps out of like hot air balloons. That'll work. Yeah, but that that's guy? not quite a jetpack. Okay. That's not Those a jetpack. Robo Chickens One One says, "I would invent some sort of genetic engineering tablets that allow you to have superpowers, but obviously you'd need to take a test before receiving the pills just to make sure you won't turn into some sort of supervillain." Of course. You can't change things. I feel like people in their lives go through different levels. Mm -hmm. Like and me at 19, probably might have been a super villain. Me now, I'd be like, I don't, I'll be the girl that walks through walls. It sounds like they're Ooh. they're saying you have to do like a Unable to feel sadness. A 68-year-old stroke victim uh, was left after the stroke unable to feel sadness. But turns out he's a really delightful, jolly, wonderful man to be around. Mm -hmm. And we asked you guys if you were unable to feel sadness or any other emotion, what would it be? Ooh, what did you guys mm. say? Ooh. What did you say? Let's find out. Let me scroll my tablet to the uh, To right be honest, spot. I really don't think I would mind not feeling sadness at all. Really? Uh yeah, I mean, I don't know. Again, remember that you don't know that you're not feeling sadness. You're not sad about not feeling sad. I still contend that it would be, it, 
it would suck to not mourn the things that you love when you lost them. Mm -hmm. Family members yes. and stuff like that. Yeah, sure. I mean, okay. would you care as much if, say, your dog ran away? Without feeling that sadness, would you have the uh, the motivation to go know. solve those type of things and those problems? Who knows? Let's see what you guys say. Well, uh, as in crazy for says, uh, jealousy, I don't think that is needed at all. I do contend, and I've said this a lot to my wife and past girlfriends, I'd be like, I'm not gonna deal with jealousy. One, because I don't get to that point ever, and I don't control you. And two, I think it's the biggest waste of emotion. Yeah, for yeah. sure. Time ever. I. It's also hate that weird jealousy. thing. Well, and for me, it's always that weird thing of like, you know, if you don't want me, then leave. Do you get jealous? You then? can get yeah. go away. You oh. like super yeah. jealous? Super jealous? No. Super I mean, jealous. I went in high school. Yeah, but like, yeah. no, no. What no do you more. tell us of like crazy sports? Uh. Things. I'm so jealous of people who have like uh, musical talent. That's envy. That envy? That's a That's sin. Envy. That's envy. You're a sinner. Yeah. You're a sinner. Sinner. You're a sinner. sinner. With your envy. Your oh. envy. <laughs> Get all adorable over there. Yeah. Yeah. It immediately turns into like a puppy. It's a, it's a defense mechanism. When people sure. try to beat me up, I'm just like. Yeah. <laughs> oh, here's another good one. A <laughs> J Mo Moho says, How about not feel fear? Oh! Oh, no, you, sometimes you need to feel you fear. You could, because that keeps you from jumping off of the cliff into the fire ocean. Yeah, but it also like True. keeps you from walking into this homicidal maniac's home. There's been times where I walk down the street and I'm like, thank, yeah, thank God for fear, because then you're like on edge and you're like looking I out. I really here. think your family should have like made a decision and moved away from the neighborhood where the home homicidal maniac was living. <laughs> That's yeah. the only problem with doing no. the news is there was one guy I was looking at the other day and he was like a, a, a psycho killer. So normal looking. Oh, yeah. So normal looking. Yeah. Like, look at the guy in Home Depot that was probably buying, like, saws and wood yep. and stuff. <laughs> Not having fear, too, would also, like, it would allow you to get up and perform if you're afraid of being That's a true. performer. Even if you can't sing very well, but then you'd what be, screw it! Can't. <laughs> It'd just be, talent shows would be a mess. Yeah, they would. <laughs> Remember yeah. the day yeah. I, would, I set I would you love that. free! I told you, you could always count on me too. Everybody! <laughs> oh, side note, did anyone see that Will Smith After Earth movie? No. After Earth? After Earth. After Earth. After Earth. <laughs> Talks about not having fear. Flashback, terrible movie. You flashback to a lot of terrible yeah. movies. Was there like not? This, stop trying to make friends Thank at movie Hello. Hi, I'm Sam. Hi. Uh, so you like After Earth? You ruined King Kong for me. <laughs> I'm sorry. <laughs> Guys, thank you so much for watching. Check out the content over the weekend. We got bloops. We got Q&As. Over on Nerd, we got, they got their own bloops where they're being messy uppy and stuff. And they've also got a movie club. So check all that out. As always, we've got our P.O. box down in the description down below. And if you guys want to help us fill up these uh, these shelves. We want to put all, all your guys' fun stuff on there. There's a Steve, there's a me and a Hayden that people made. Aww. Somebody sent us some dinosaurs. Love the dinosaurs. Dinosaurs and stuff. So yeah, just uh, if you guys want to be part of the set, please uh, feel free to, uh, to do so. Yeah. Oh, also, one other thing. Speaking of posters that do not blink, there's a new source fed poster. Oh, there is. You should probably get it. It's probably up right now when we're talking over B roll. Should I make the editors make the eyes blink on the poster? Oh, no. <laughs> Darren's, Darren's like, like, no, 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 no. Don't you dare. So that's it, you guys. Thank you for watching. Yeah. Uh, my name is Joe Beretta. I'm Lee Newton. I'm Sam Basher. We're going to end this with a sexy pillow fight. Ooh. Oh, no. Oh, no. Oh, no. Oh, thank you for coming Ow. to my party. Oh, no. Thank you for coming to my party. It doesn't Thank feel so much sexy. It. sexy. It feels abused. Sexy. Sex. Yes. Sexy. <laughs>